Well, that's right. Last video, we got arrested. <laughs> All right. And we also got pneumonia last video. <laughs> we still haven't got that fixed. But we're starting this one off uh, in prison. Okay. We've been blackmailed into going undercover for this son of a bitch up here. Hello. Hello. So we'll see how this goes. Hey. Hey. Can you get the hell out of my way? Yeah, thank you. All right, you know, I apologize. You said, excuse me, I apologize. Ah, there you are. Excellent. Now mm -hmm. that we've established your level of cooperation with us, I want to introduce you to your new home. This is the operation center of the UC Vigilance. SysDef's nerve center dedicated to the destruction of the Crimson Fleet. <laughs> and this is me shooting my way out. No, I'm going to get my ass off if I do that. Um, you're gonna need Which one is precisely why we're taking a more clandestine approach. We need eyes and ears inside the Crimson Fleet. Someone who can feed us information, evidence, and expose their weaknesses. The catch is that you can't just knock on their front door <laughs> and ask for an application. Getting inside is going to take some finesse. Um, I do. Our intelligence has managed to find a possible opening into the Crimson Fleet through Sersha Borden, one of their contacts. Sersha? She works for the Trade Authority in Sidonia, so you'll be using a container of Aurora we've loaded on your ship to get her attention. That's right. So it'll be your job to convince this person that you're the real deal. Once you bluff your way into the Crimson Fleet, then the operation proceeds to evidence gathering. That's where my second in command, Lieutenant Gillian Toft, comes into the picture. She'll explain everything you need to know. All right, I'm gonna tell you what. Right now, if there's a possibility to join the Crimson Fleet and say to hell with these guys, I'm that's what I'm doing. Just so you know. Eager to get going. Good. Mm -hmm. Remember, this entire operation rests on your ability to infiltrate the Crimson Fleet and bring us the evidence we need to take them down. <coughs> sure, whatever. I'm just. I wouldn't expect any less. Whatever you want to hear is Look, what I'm going to tell you. Before you begin, I want to make something perfectly clear. As an undercover operative for UC Sysdef, You'll be expected to follow our code of conduct and ethics. Allow yourself to stray too far off the path, and you stand a good chance of spiraling out of control. Listen, yeah, exactly. I don't follow well, you. better learn quick. Otherwise, I'll start looking for someone to take your place. Anyway, it's time to hand you over to Lieutenant Toft. She'll brief you about the details of the evidence gathering portion of the operation. Now, get out of here and good luck. What happens if I get arrested while I'm undercover? For your own safety, nobody but myself and the crew of the Vigilance will be aware that you're working for the United Colonies. Basically, if you land in jail, you're going to have to deal with the fines. Hey, fuck! That's easy to answer. You don't. We'll be monitoring your activities from the vigilance and attempting to keep it within your vicinity. When you feel you've gathered enough evidence and at the completion of your assignments, head back here for a debrief. Beyond that, you're completely on your own. Cool. You have your orders. Yep. <laughs> well then, hello. How are you? you doing a little table dance back here? Shit. Let me get okay, involved. Hello. hello. Baby girl, look. Uh, I don't see an ATM or anything, but I got a few credits, you know. Um, oh, you singing Pardon. too? What's up, bitch? All right. We don't have a lot of time, so I need you to listen up. While you're working undercover, it's imperative that you gather as much evidence as possible. 
If you find any records that look suspicious or incriminating, you bring it to me. Is that understood? Sure, sure, sure. You better make it, because Commander Akande cashed in all his chips to get this operation off the ground. I want data slates, computer downloads, handwritten notes. Hell, I'll take anything if it'll get those bastards thrown into the brig. Security. For the sake of the settled systems, I hope you're right. That minor skirmish you had with them on Vectera was nothing compared to the death and destruction those pirates leave behind. If you've seen what I've seen, you'd understand why I'm pushing you so hard. I'm another little thing. Yes, of course. I'm sorry if I brought up any painful memories. Oh, uh, one last thing. A bit of good news, a store? actually. Requisitions? Commander Akande has authorized a credit disbursement for each piece of evidence that you return. Oh. As compensation for your efforts. Hmm. <laughs> Credits? Commander Akande came up with the idea. He was concerned you might not help us simply because it was the right thing to do. Well, he would be All correct. Right. We've loaded a container of Aurora into your ship's cargo hold. We're also providing you with a sample you can use to tease the goods. We've cleared your ship for launch. Proceed to Sidonia. Make contact with Searsha Bowden. And with any luck, she'll point you to the Crimson Fleet. That should do it. You're dismissed. Don't worry, the container's been registered with UC Security, so you shouldn't have any trouble. Even if you're scanned. Of course, if we find out you tried to sell it to someone outside the boundaries of this particular operation, mm -hmm. well, I don't think I need to tell you the consequences of making that mistake i think you should bitch we'll be here if you need us don't oh. threaten me oh ah. y'all got a uh any of them requisitions <laughs> officers around here maybe it's a bolt you sound a little too excited about this strange engine noises aren't my idea of a good thing but that's how the ship hell is this it would be Hey, don't don't mind me. Alright. Okay. Terms of fleet tactics. Uh personal documents. Terms of you can watch this. Read this if you want. Nice. I'm not reading it out loud. I'm no speed reading it in, in my head. I took speed reading as a kid. Like I was, uh, I don't want to say I was forced, but I was, I was told to take speed reading classes so I can read through like a book particularly fast. But then the, from what I remember in the lessons, yeah, what... you, uh, you learn to like delete certain things when you're reading. Right? Like, let's say you're reading a book and it's talking about uh, someone's home <laughs> where they grew up, right? It, there's a lot of, like, expository dialogue talking about, like, the grass was the color of green that, that reminded him of his mother's eyes. Blah, blah, blah. Yada. Like, all this just detail shit. Like, a book is no bullshit. It's about half, 50% of it is just dialogue like that that's explaining what it is. So you learn to like skim past that shit and not read it. So you only read like plot points and time to move on. Stuff of importance. Which takes all the joy out of reading like I heard your certain types of books, you know what I mean? Alright. Two dozen body languages? Mmm. Mmm. All right. Now, I had contraband on my ship. They caught me, arrested me, and then put more contraband on my ship. Isn't that sick? No, ain't worth a fuck. Oh, wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa.
scan Phobos. I can't land on this because it's a comet, I guess. Or a uh, meteor or some shit. Let's go to the moon of your anus. Because <laughs> I want to put one of my little bases now. Or my little outpost or whatever the hell it's called. I just got XP. 50 XP. Huh? How you doing, sweet pea? Well, I'm a. Don't call me Sweet Pea. Extreme environment. Damn it! Hold right, I'm getting pissed. Mercury, Venus. What the fuck is Earth? Earth. Should we go check out Earth? You'd be a lot better if you had a bigger book allowance. <laughs> you know me so well, Dad. So, what do you say? But oh, there's still some resources left on Earth. Um, what is that? This is water, lead, water, lead. I mean, lead ain't worth the shit. Frozen plains. Okay, I'm landing here just just to try to put one of my little uh, outposts down. Cause I, 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 looks clean. Let's set it down. Damn, this is Earth. She said Earth lost its atmosphere, and this is what happened. Look at that. Okay. Place an outpost beacon, baby. Okay, let's put one right here. So bear with me because I don't really know what I'm doing. Let's just delete that rock just in case it gets in the damn way. Placing apples means allows you to build objects and structures. Navigate the build menu, Q and E. Help us to build from items and resources. Yeah. Place feel like home. Okay. I can afford one of these. Must be placed on a resource vi vein. Is this one? Well, that's a resource vein right there. Power in order to function. Build a power source from the power category. Okay. Craft instructions, builder, storage, power. Nice little solar array right here.
Hell yeah. Wait a minute. I didn't mean to build that. How do I stop this bitch? Is there a way to... To... Disassemble something? There's gotta be, right? There we go. Nice. Create output link. Oh man, oh man. This is about to get deep. Landing pad. Oh my god. Fuck it. We're gonna put it right here. Just because we're playing around. We don't really care what this looks like. We're literally just playing around. Weapon rack. Oh, look how sick this is. You can build a whole ass base. And I can build a turret? Oh, it takes three power. I think these are four, that's taking five. So I got three left over. But let's put a turret. You know, why not? I can't build a turret up here? Fuck it. Tell you what, I take my shit. There you go. Amazing. Look at our wonderful base. So now I can land. I can jump right off of here. Look at that. Take lead. Amazing. It actually really is amazing. Like the amount of shit I bet you can build. Oh, man. And how dope is this landing pad? What can I do with this? Oh. Nothing. Okay. Well, that's going to be fun as hell, by the way. But I don't want to spend too much time doing that right this second. Yes, infallible one. So long, Earth. Lifting off now. stable let's just scan this debris and see if there's anything floating around that we might could might be interested in before we leave oh that's a negative ghost rider
Show me that. Gotcha. I was about to go all the wrong ass way. I was about to fly to another goddamn solar system. Oh, I lived on Mars for an entire year. And I'm convinced I'll never get used to the dusty air. <laughs> You'll be fine. Okay. I need to see a fucking doctor while we're here. Because I'm not feeling great. How you doing? Y'all got a doctor in here? I feel like if I talk to you, you're gonna Welcome tell me to, to do Sidonia something. Welcome to Security. I'm Commander Vincent Woodard, Chief of Planetary Security. Nice the eyes. Former head of the Red Devils program here on Mars. I tend to deal with security at a high governmental level, whereas my associate Booth over there handles day-to-day -day security issues. So if you're looking to report a minor crime or misdemeanor, see him. But if there's something I can help you with, feel free to ask. Only the finest bunch of soldiers to ever grace the UC with their service. Of course, I may be biased as a Red Devil myself and head of the program. Well, former, I should say. Program's been defunct since the armistice that ended the colony wars. It put a stop to any and all Xeno warfare. I fought to keep them operational here, but the top brass concluded that without their unique alien bioweapon training, there was no need for a separate elite soldier program. Hmm. Cool. Bye. Cool. Found a clutch of heat leeches. Uh... Spear. How about medical? <laughs> Broken spear. Engineering, trade authority Talk outpost. Talk to me if you reckon you can hack it as a bounty hunter. Ooh, I actually reckon I can, but let me reckon to go cure myself of some kind of disease first. I need to go talk to that motherfucker. Stay away from the sixth circle unless you're a minor. Release. Here we go. Doc. <sighs> let me guess. You're here because you were working a cutter. Accidentally nipped your thumb off and you need me to reattach it again? Hmm. Uh... Well, that's a relief. You'd be surprised how often it happens. <sighs> Sorry. I tend to think the worst, since the overwhelming majority of my patients come here to treat entirely preventable accidents. I know it's my job to help people, and I love doing it, but I do wish they'd be a little more careful down in the mines. I'm Dr. Flynn. What can I do for you today? Um. Okay, one moment while I look you over. Oh, not good. Not good at all. You're gonna need a lot of care. Oh, yeah. Do my wounds, cure my affliction, take care of it all. Yeah, 750, that's not bad. A stitch here and a stitch there. You'll be right as rain. Looks like we're gonna need the strong stuff to cure you. Hold still. You're good to go. Careful around the affected area. Give it time to heal completely. Okay. Thanks. But yeah, are you okay? Bollocks. Is that how I come off now? Oh, mm -hmm. work's getting to me, I suppose. It's just... You see, no one on this bloodied planet seems to follow basic safety precautions. It's always, Dr. Flynn, reattach me arm, <laughs> or help me with this frostbite. Well, maybe if you took the time to properly dress yourself for the outside, you wouldn't be losing your fingers, you idiot. <laughs> Sorry for the rant. You just, just for a change, I'd rather be treating the common cold and not some horrific yet entirely preventable accident. Fair. See you around. Woo! Feeling healthy. Feeling healthy as hell now. Okay, I need to talk to that bitch, but first. We got lots of stuff. Just ask. Yep. Cool. 
That's what we do here. Okay, let me sell some shit. I actually don't know what all I have. That's that's extra. Oh yeah, sell this shit. There you go. Easy. Sell from ship inventory. Oh, that's all resources. Okay. No, no, no. Sounds like a plan. Sell. Okay. Sell these packs. Shit out of here. Shit out of here. Helmets. Shit out of here. Shit out of here. I don't think this is for anything. Coachman. Okay. Sell the rescue axe. Hey, we're fine. We're fine. Thank you. What are you yeah, selling? Let's get you hooked up. I meant to look before I left. Weapons. Assassin's ca Ooh. Damn. Nice. Okay. We got any health packs? How about these, you think? Yeah. All right, fuck off. Yo, stay good out there. Damn. What's good, Sershi? Sershi, what the fuck is your name? If you're here to buy or sell, you might want to talk to Octai. I'm busy. I'm here to sell, but I'm looking for you. No, I'm here to unload a sensitive shipment. And by sensitive, I'm guessing you mean something you don't want UC security sticking their noses into. I can probably help you with that. What have you got for me? Um, let's talk price first. I need to seem like a pirate. I'm not talking price until I know what the hell I'm buying. Okay, fair. Hmm. Aurora, huh? Nice. A little too hard to handle, though. What else you got? The Trade Authority turning away contraband. Now I've seen everything. If you can't handle it, point me to someone who can. Yep. All I'm going to point at is the ceiling, with my middle finger. Get that stuff out of here before UC security catches on. Of course, if there's a finder's fee you're offering, I might, well, bend the rules a little bit. <laughs> God damn it. I'm gonna pay. You know what? Fuck you, bitch. Sure, go ahead. You shoot me, and the TA will have bounty hunters on your ass before you even get back to the spaceport. Listen, love, I've heard it all. Threats bounce right off. So either cough up the finder's fee or try and sell that shipment on your own. God damn you. You know, it's funny. Suddenly, I do remember someone who might be able to unload that stuff for you. Well, well. It appears she suddenly remembers everything. Hmm, how nice. There's a buddy of mine who runs with the Crimson Fleet. Goes by the name Adler Kemp. If he isn't passed out, you can find him killing the rest of his brain cells at the Broken Spear. Oh, and uh, it's been a pleasure doing business with you. Mm-hmm. Got something for me? What? 
No! <laughs> I ain't got shit for you! You got something for me? The United Colonies Department of Labor would like to remind you that working too much overtime is harmful to your This bitch kinda fine as hell, huh? Bitch, move! Mining takes all taps. What are you doing, shitter? Unless you're here to serve me another drink, you can turn around and walk away. Hey, why don't you say that a little louder? I don't think every single UC guard in Sedonia heard you. You don't want yelling, uh, bitch. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I think we can help you with this. If you've got a whole shipment of this stuff, you're going to need to move it fast. But you're going to have to do something for us first. You're a clever one, aren't you? Let's just say I have a certain influential affiliation. And leave it at that. Basically, you want that Aurora moved? I'm your guy. Whatever, let's go. Right down to business. And no small talk. I like it. Well, this is utterly ridiculous. Do we really have to jump through these hoops to get what we need from you? <sighs> Lady, if you want me to move that shipment for your pal here, you're going to do whatever the hell I want. You got that? Now listen up, because I'm not going to repeat myself. I need you to deal with a miner who's racked up a bunch of debt. He probably spent it all on booze, not that I blame him. Either way, I want that money back. What do I need to do here? Write you an instruction manual? You can do this loud, you can do this quiet. I don't care. I just want my goddamn money, and I want this guy to remember who he screwed over. All right. Perfect. His name's Carl Fielding. I think you'll find him wandering around the Deimos Miners' quarters. Don't worry, you can't miss him. Just look for the most miserable looking guy in the entire place. <laughs> Alright. Down we go. Wait a minute. Oh, he's right here. He's right here! Butternuts! Where the fuck is this boy I'm looking for? What do you sell? I offer a great opportunity for people who don't wish to deal with the trade authority. Oh. Hi, welcome to Jane's, Sidonia's only 100% independent one stop shop. I apologize if I'm a little distracted. I'm currently dealing with a little issue, but please let me know if there's anything I can get for you. Let me know. What you selling? Sure thing. Take a look. Okay, fuck all. Weapons. You sell a cutter. That ain't worth a shit. You sell those two things. They suck. Okay, that sucks. Uh huh. Listen, I'm not trying to be mean. I'm really not. But, uh, you ain't worth the shit. Yeah, bye. Yeah, yeah, you ain't worth the shit. Hey, you look pretty miserable. Something I can help you with? Adler Kemp. Who the heck is that? <clears throat> of course. I owe money. Unless you're independently wealthy. Everyone's in debt nowadays. I owe Deimos. I owe my landlord. I owe Galbank. Heck, I have a tab at Parsec Deep at Sespear. It's an endless list. So why don't you just leave me here? Let me get drunk and find someone else to bother. Okay? Uh, no. Adler, you said? Nope. I 
think you have me mixed up with someone else. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> look, I'm tired. It's been a long day in the mines. I just want to go home, wash off the dust, and relax. This has been fun, though. Whatever. <laughs> I'm sure your funeral will be lovely. Uh, hey, hey, now. <laughs> Take it easy there. Let me think about that person you mentioned. Uh, Adler, was it? Yeah, you remember it now, huh? Oh, wait. You mean that Adler? Yeah, sorry. I thought you were talking about someone else. Yeah, I bet so. <laughs> your broke ass. I told him I'd pay up next week when Deimos cuts our next profit share check. Uh, I'll even bring it to him personally. Hmm? Sound good? Uh, no. It uh, does not. Come on. Give me a break. What the? Look, I haven't got a single credit to spare right now. Okay? You can't squeeze blood from a stone. You know? Right? <laughs> Perhaps he's already been through enough. Sir, shut your dumb ass up! Listen, I'm tired of persuading. Oh, I'm, I'm what games? Why are you doing this to me? I don't have the money. You gonna give me what I'm after. Got three turns. No way. Fuck! I'm already working my fingers to the bone. Why the hell would what? I deplete my savings? It, to pay off a... I hear you. Do you? Bitch! I guess I'm only putting off the inevitable. Yeah, that's what I thought. Please, tell Adler I'm sorry for trying to wiggle out of the debt. I didn't have much of a choice. Damn, he had $3,000. That's right, it's your broke ass. Where did I just go? I just followed the blue dot. Detonation occurred in five, four, Detonation. three, hey! two, one. Oh, shit. Okay. Particle detonation concluded. It is now safe to resume normal activity. Here, here's your, a break. Here's the fucking money, son. Have something for me? There. Would you look at that? I knew that bum was holding out on me. He going to be a problem anymore? Or did he get the message? I killed him. Nice. Nice. You're kind of a natural at this. Leaning on deadbeats comes easy to you. I like that. It comes easy to you? Oh. <laughs> If you like this kind of work, I can get you more. A lot more. You think you can handle running with my, uh, associates? Do you think they can handle me? <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. I like your style. All right. I'll call ahead and get a hold of Neva Mora. She's second to the big boss himself. Head out to Europa. You'll find her there. I suggest you listen to whatever she has to say. Oh, and I've taken care of that Aurora shipment for you, too. Don't spend all that cash in one place. Damn, that was quick. Ooh, woo! Okay, right quick. Let me, let me holler, baby girl. Hey, you brave. Coming to see a bona fide tracker. God damn. Hey, darling. You look like the type who doesn't mind getting their hands dirty. Nah. The Trackers Alliance Not at all. always use more bounty hunters to round up and kill wanted criminals. If that feels like your speed, talk to me. Or check out our posts on the mission boards. I think I'd talk to you. Uh-oh. Good. Here's the short of it. I'm only stationed here because I made a mistake. 
Killed the wrong bounty, and the right one got away. It's bugged me ever since. Now, I heard rumors that this no-good, dirty quarry's been lurking around Mars, but I ain't had the good fortune of him strolling on in here. I think he's smart enough to know better. I got a plan in place to find him, but I gotta prove to my other tracker contact that he's here. That's where you come in. Just gotta plan a sensor. No danger to you. I'm just gonna shit on this guy for you, okay? Hell no. If I'd have wanted you to do that, I'd be asking you to do that. Now, nah, I got a good friend, tracker buddy who stuck by me through and through. Gonna split the hall with him as soon as he brings the mark in. That ain't up for debate or negotiation. Under no circumstances are you to interact with my quarry, or you'll find yourself at the wrong end of a bounty. Hmm. All right, so you're gonna want to take this here sensor and put it way up at the tippy top of the old Mars launch pad tower where it's nice and unobstructed. You're gonna want to make sure you've got a boost pack to help get yourself up there, or else it's gonna be a tough climb. Mars gravity's on the low side, but not that low. It'll track down my Mark's chip signal, assuming he shows, and I'll call in my partner to take care of him. Clear out and come back to me as soon as you're done so you don't spook the quarry. Get it? Got it? Good. Hmm. I like this chick. Really use an air to brow right now. Same. A cold one would really. Look at the bartender the viewport. Mm. It's such a generic beer, but I don't care. Where's the bounty hunter shit? There it is. Pop. Go ahead and show me that on the map. Pop. Wait a minute, if I just travel, would it take me outside? I know the door was right there, but does this take me straight out? Oh man, that's so sick. Place the sensor. Oh shit. Okay, we're good. <laughs> woo, woo! Mars is kind of sick. I'm still scan while I'm out here in case there's anything worth a damn. Now? Bitch, I'm mining. Are you blind? Um, are you shooting at flies now? Such a dumbass up. Bitch. Ooh. That wasn't lead, that was aqueous hematite. Bum, 
I need to get a longer fucking laser. I'll tell you that. Is this aqueous hematite? No, it's not. It's just lead. I don't know what lead is used for, but I hope it's used for a lot of different shit. Because it's like the main thing I find. We got to get all the way up there. Don't mind if we do. Should be kind of easy. Boing. 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 Ah. Um. Wait a damn minute. There we go. Easy. <gasps> oh, shit. safe you think I can get all the way up there from here yep yes we can Run up this. Boom, boom, boom. Ah, we make a short work of this. Home free. Don't fall off for the love of God. Yep. Oh man, fast traveling is sick. I have something I need to discuss with you. Yes? <laughs> yes. We can discuss that shit later. I gotta, uh, I gotta holler at old baby girl right quick. The miners pretty much run the lower levels here. I got it, baby. You I did it. Checkers normally work alone, but this is us. Good. I'm already getting readings from it. Nothing yet, but when he shows, we'll get him. Here's your pay. Think of it as your cut of the bounty for your assistance. Well, 2,500? <laughs> Don't mind if I do. We'll get that bottom feeding scum sucker when he shows his face. We did. Soon after you left the signal paint. Soon as it did, I sent word to my fellow tracker, and he made a move on our guy. Nice. And on top of that, we bagged another wanted criminal. Turns out our guy was using the launch pad as a rendezvous point to traffic illicit goods, including human organs and worse. We caught the buyer as well, thanks to you. Nice. See those ads for Eugen? You thinking about checking it out? Got any more, any more work? So, you're fixing to take yourself on a little bounty hunt. Well, look no further than the broken spear. The what? Trackers Alliance posts jobs on the mission board over there. Big old console, can't miss it. Now, I want them look, directly from you. Much as I'm itching to get back out there and take down wanted marks on my own, I can't help you any more than that. So, don't come crying to me if you can't hack it, you hear? Oh, darling, a bounty on you. That is quite the pickle you've gotten yourself into. 
<laughs> this ain't a normal bounty. Looks like someone's paying Ecliptic and paying them good. Mm. But don't uh -oh. worry, sugar. I got you. For 3,000 creds, I can make sure your sheet's as clear as a summer night on Parima. Remove wanted trait permanently? Yeah. Get rid of my little wanted shit. I just made 3,000 from the mission, so. Then you're all set. Now, keep in mind, this is separate from any crimes you've done. Don't go shooting up a saloon and tell the marshal I cleared you for it. Nice. Okay. Yeah, well, see ya. You know, I felt, I thought we really had something. And you kind of really ruined that for me. Destroy the Crimson Fleet Ghost. Survey, transfer miners. I like, I like this. Destroy the Crimson Fleet, we'll take that. We'll take that. We'll take that. Planet, survey progress on the planet simple card. Yeah. I'm not transporting no fucking miners. Just because the governor's office is right out there. Bro, bam, bam. I should have bought some more shotgun shells. I didn't even look. And I really want a sniper. Oh, when you're ready to launch. Um, actually, hang on. You wanted to talk. So let's talk right quick. When you have a moment, I'd like to speak to you. Yeah, no shit. How are you? Can I help? Remember our last conversation? When you told me the artifacts made you feel like you were being pulled across the entire galaxy. Well, it got me thinking, so I dove into our archives and started looking through Constellation's older journal entries. Just because I wasn't familiar with the experience you described doesn't mean the same might have been true for my predecessor. Hmm. Really? I'm surprised that I haven't. After reading those journals, all of the pleasant memories of my time spent with Aja just started flooding back. Well, there's no reason to be jealous. They were just, I don't know, different times. Aja was the one that taught me the ropes at Constellation and took me under her wing as her protege. Hey, so I pinched a few ideas from my old boss. <laughs> Can you blame me? At any rate, we logged quite a few discoveries together, but it was the actual journey that I cherished the most. Oh. Exactly. For me, it was all about the quieter moments. There was nothing quite like sitting back and watching space bend while listening to Aja spin vivid stories to fill the time. Oh, I find that sort of cozy isolation the best way to really get to know someone. Oh, you want some cozy isolation? She. Yeah, you know. Being alone in interstellar space, nothing but light years of black around you. Some people find that terrifying. I find it comfortable. It helps me bond with my shipmates. <laughs> so I've noticed. I'll take that as a compliment. Thank you. You know, all this talk about Aja reminds me that my time with her was a gift. I miss her dearly 
<laughs> oh, is she, uh, dead? No, she retired. Living on Porima 2 now, I think. Come to think of it, if we're ever out that far, perhaps we could pay her a visit and I could make proper introductions. Little three? Little threesome? Okay. Well, I don't expect you to be a carbon copy of Aja. Just be yourself. You see, it's clear that we share the same hunger to discover what's out there. And that, well, that's what intrigues me about you. Ooh, I'd like to discover more about what we have right here. I... I don't know if I deserve to be that close to anyone right now. If you knew about the things that I've done, the way my life's unfolded, Shh. I think your Shh. opinion of me might change. No. Please give me some time. I, 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 I have to go. Don't get all fluttered. But you, you, God damn it, Captain Blue Balls, taking off. Are you okay, Dad? I'm about tired of this fucking kid. Yeah, you're sweet to worry now. Lift off looks good or system's not? Dad's just not as young. I'm gonna drop these fucking kids off. I'm gonna jettison their asses into space. All right, that's what I'm about to do. I don't give two fucks about fucking, uh... <laughs> I can't think of a cowboy name. Billy the Kid back there. What is this? Okay, I, was, I thought I was about to have to kill some. Okay, um, do a little map action. Zoom out. Round of, that's where we're supposed to go, right? Yeah. We have to be able to upgrade our ship at some point, right? Wow, look who finally had the guts to show up. Looks like Adler finally did something right for once. What's up, shitter? How you doing? Oh shit. Oh shit. I'm sorry. You and the rust bucket. Pick up the damn mic. I hit the, I, I, uh, I meant to hit the button. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I held it when I meant to touch it. So, big shot. I hear Adler thinks you're good enough to join our crew. Mm-hmm. Damn right I am. Your life on that? Because the only way out of our organization is with a warhead up your grab drive. So, before I put you to work, let's get everything out in the open. I don't know if Adler mentioned it, and for his sake, I hope he hasn't. But you aren't about to sign up with any average pirate crew. You're signing up with the Crimson Fleet. That's if you get through this little task I have planned for Look, you. Look, Crimson's my color, There's baby. There's a medical supply ship called the Rigana, jumping into Enceladus's orbit. On board that ship, you'll find a traitor named Austin Reek. I want him dead. Easy. This job isn't about the loot. But I suppose every dog needs its scraps. Keep whatever worthless junk is on that ship. Just remember, the only thing that matters is that Rake dies. Easy. Consider that shit done. It's done when Rake stops breathing. Head back here when you're finished. And don't keep me waiting for long. So that's the notorious Nova Mora. I have to say... If she's the finest that the Crimson Fleet has to offer, joining them might be a terrible mistake. Uh, I heard that. I've been tracking Rick for months. He's making it tough, not gonna lie. He changes his location and identity so often, it's costing me a small fortune just to keep tabs. But you know what? It's worth every damn cred. 
He's made me look like a fool in front of Delgado. And I'm gonna have his head on a pike. Okay. I don't care why you want him dead. <gasps> Fuck, I'm sorry. Okay. Um... Go ahead and wait a minute. Go ahead and uh set course to enchilada. Then we travel to enchilada. Whoa. Boy, do I have some bad news for you. You have a crewman on board I'm looking for. All right. And what are your intentions with this crewman? Um... I have one demand. Kill Austin Rake. Do that and I'll let you go. Here's what's going to happen. You're going to open your hatch, and I'm going to board. Damn it. I do not have choice, do I? Okay. Docking bay is open. Let's talk. That's what the fuck I thought. Come here, bitch. Coming in hot. Open up that ass, baby. Hmm. Right in there. Hmm. Like a glove. Are we lifting off right away, or do you need a little bit of time? Bitch, huh? We just got here. I need a little bit of time. You know, I don't know, at least a little bit of time to go in there and find a motherfucker, kill, maybe a... Oh, he, look, he looks like he's ready. Okay, here's what we're going to do. Because there might be different options in here. But the first and foremost option should be... The fucking gun's down! I am not sure what to make of you being here. If you wanted to kill us, you could have done that from your ship. If you wanted our cargo, we could have jettisoned it. I guess I should just stop talking and let you say your piece. Yes. I don't know who's listening over to comms. That is true, which means you don't want somebody to know what you are really up to. Very now, do true. do you mind telling us what this is all about? Hmm. Austin Brake is a Crimson Fleet pirate. Kill him, and I'll let you go. Do I like that? Or do I just kill everyone on this fucking ship? Hmm. Maybe we do this? You really do not know which one of us is Rake, do you? And you do not seem to care either, which makes me think you really want to save him. Okay, I have idea. We can strike his name from manifest, make it so he was never on board. No. Then, when we dock, we will leave him on this ship and deliver him to another port. The fleet won't buy that. Yeah, I think this is the safest one. That is fair. We do not want any part of the fleet. Is that all right with you, Austin? Do I have a choice? It does not appear you do. This well, fucking doucher. You go back to your ship and we will make sure Rake was never on ours. 
And in case any of your handlers get suspicious, here. We had an extra crate of supplies loaded, in case one got damaged. This should be proof you were not here to bargain. That's cute. I'm not here to this bargain. Aside, the people of New Homestead will be grateful for these supplies. I thought we were dead. I can't believe it. Open this god! Now what? They're gonna put me in a cis-death prison? I'm not saying it's worse than death, but... Hey, pretty damn open close. this shit up we now. make sure Rake's name is taken. And I hope you do. Thank you for letting us go. All right, guys. Just so you know, here's what, here's what. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I have to do this. I apologize. I thought we were. You thought what? Have you taken leave of your senses? Rake was your target. I didn't sign on to this voyage to take part in mass murder. You'll be alright. You'll don't be alright. Don't leave any of that behind. Oh, you don't like mass murder, but you damn sure don't mind me, you know, robbing the hell out of these dead motherfuckers. Okay. I still can't get in there? Well, fuck. Okay, right, so there's no reason to kill him. Y'all are lucky that I just had a glimpse of the future, and it uh, it appears to me that. I this can't get in there. Aside, the people of New Homestead will be grateful for these supplies. On dock. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Undocking complete, Captain. Okay. Wait a minute. Let's scan this bitch. Stream environment. Fuck. I really need to upgrade my shit so I can, um... I can establish bases on extreme environments. Damn, Mercs just don't know how to take a hit. Hey, Rook, wanna help me with some target practice? Oh, I got some for his ass. Ooh, shit. Hey! These motherfuckers. Grab drive out of commission. Bitch, my grab drive. Target's jump system down. Enemy, their grab drives down. <laughs> They're not jumping out of here. Okay, okay. Yes. <laughs> grab drive back online. Jump system online. Okay, his ass is dead. I'm gonna loot him. I know I should be fighting, but I'm gonna loot instead. I'm still gonna loot. I'm still gonna loot. No, 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 no. I'm gonna loot. Fuck! I got greedy! There we go. Boosted. Then we, then we slam around. Okay. Tell you what, we need to get some shields are good to go. Please, is that your best shot? Okay, I'm coming back in, girl. I'm gonna break you open. That won't even leave a scratch. Coming to help. Coming in hot. They getting shit on, baby. Can I have a pet? A 
The girl sitting there talking when I'm having a space battle? We think you're going, bitch? Huh? Oh god. Oh god. You might you think you might could I don't know fight the one that's whooping my ass? Shit on. Last one? You ready to get shit on? Tags they you tags their grab drive. Enemies grab drive disabled. Their grab drives down. Shit on. Our jump systems back up. Hell, they asked you my ass. I'm looting, baby. Oh, baby, roof. What you got for me? This is not easy, by the way. Looting in space. No, don't hail the fucking ash. Astria. There we go. Take. Nice. Some more shit right here. Hit the brakes. So far, this could be done a little better. There we go. Okay. And then this one. Yeah, I flew way out here before I killed his ass. So. Ready, hit the brakes. Oh, well, shit. Come on. Oh god, we're gonna I crash into you. Control, I can't control. But it definitely went faster after you jumped into the fight. Now tell me about the Ragana. Give me some good news, then we can go celebrate. We're about to crash into you as soon as we're done talking, by the way. You know what? I have no idea, and it's frustrating the hell out of me. I suppose I could have pissed off someone I screwed over in the past, but there's been so many, I've lost count. Okay. Um, listen. I'm gonna lie to you, okay? Huh. No kidding. That'll make Delgado happy, seeing as our hands are clean. I would have preferred if you hadn't left witnesses behind, but at least you got the job done. Anyway... You wanted into the Crimson Fleet? Well, you're in. Yep, it's that simple. Nice. Hope this business with Rakes taught you something. Because I'm about to stick my neck out and vouch for you. If you screw up and I wind up looking like an asshole, I'm going to send someone after you. We clear? Crystal. Best decision you ever made. Yeah? last person who said that was rake so you've already dug yourself a hole about six feet deep 
Now that you know the deal, it's time to see what you signed up for. I'm gonna upload the coordinates for our headquarters in the Crick system. Spacers call it the key, the fleet calls it home. Head out there as soon as you can. Don't keep me waiting long. Well, we're in. I hope you know what you're doing. No, I don't. I don't know shit. Where'd she go? Oh, she vanished. Got it. What planet is this? Europa? Have I scanned this bitch yet? Ooh. What we got on here? We got Chlorosaurilones. There's a science outpost over here. Okay. I'm not doing all this right now, though. All right. Uh, full disclosure, I just took a, a quick break. Well, a quick break. I took like an hour and a half break, and I went and ate dinner. And uh, I forget exactly what the hell we were doing. <laughs> Report to the vigilance. Okay. Okay, set course. Travel. Let's go. What's this? That's where we are. Yeah. Rook meets King. Report to the vigilance. So what do we just do? Um. Oh, right. We joined the damn red, the crimson, crimson shitters. Some high level buddies. Let's talk to these shitters. Welcome back, Agent. You're clear to dock at docking port one. Oh, this is going back to these guys. Got it. Got it. This is the UC, um, what are they called? The Space Police. That's what we call them. I mean, some popcorn. It was fun. Commander now what? Wants to see you. Follow me. I had a friend on the Ragana. I hope I'll be able to see him next time we're on shore leave. All right, get the hell out the way. I got somewhere to be. I saw one of the ensigns get an Alpha Centauri from Officer Petrosian. We got the message from the Ragana about Austin Rick. We had him dropped off at a separate port, off the books. Mm -hmm. Suffice to say, he's got a lot to answer for. Would have been fine killing Rick myself, but I didn't want to traumatize the crew. Yep, I risk my cover. I do. I know it's a delicate tightrope, and it doesn't go unnoticed that you're risking your own life to walk it. Every tightrope act needs a safety net. We appreciate the fact that you're behind us, Commander. Oh, one more thing before we move on. For transparency's sake, you should know we were the ones that hired Ecliptic to attack Neva's ship. There was concern after what happened with the Regana that you might have trouble earning Neva's trust. Coming to her rescue ensure that would not be a problem. Huh. That's pretty risky. But a gamble that hopefully paid off. On that note, how did things go with Neva? Were you able to join the fleet? Yep. Then it worked. You're in. Sounds like everything is going as expected. Now it's time for the next phase of the mission. Our intel on Searsha was correct. After we received reports on your interaction with Adler Kemp, we picked up on your rendezvous with Neva Mora. Our files indicate she's second in command, so getting on a good side will ensure you get into the Crimson Fleet. Yes. You pass your first test and you're still alive. But before we get too confident, 
That either means she suspects nothing, or she intends to make an example of you later. Just remember, these are ruthless criminals, so don't let your guard down. And their ruthlessness is only surpassed by their cunning. You should proceed with caution, regardless of how well you think you've ingratiated yourself. So what's next for you on Neva's agenda? Ooh. Yeah, I told you I would lie to these motherfuckers as soon as I can. Strange. She must want to vet you some more. Still, it should only be a matter of time before they invite you to the key. That's likely where you'll meet Delgado. Delgado is the leader of the Crimson Fleet. I have a profile here with some information on his background. You'll want to know the individual cadences of every member of the fleet, but Delgado's most of all. Agreed. The last thing we need is to infiltrate the fleet, only to be kicked out because we've underestimated one of their people. I don't disagree, but it's important to know your enemy and the best way to defeat them. In any case, now that you're with the fleet, you'll be operating independently. We will shadow you eventually, but we'll need to maintain our distance for now, especially while you're on the key. This will also give us time to bolster our defenses, should we need to engage with the fleet in the future. Sir, on that note, shall we begin implementing the upgrade to our shields? Immediately, Lieutenant. Notify the engineers and relay the information to the crew. I hope your entry into the fleet has overcome any doubts you may have had regarding your mission. It certainly increased my estimates on success. Keep up the good work. We'll expect further reports. Dismissed. They suck my boss. <coughs> um... There's still nobody on this ship that'll sell me a goddamn thing, huh? First mission on the books and no casualties. Good work. Can I go this way? What's in there? Get me the hell off this ship. Don't don't think I don't remember that y'all motherfuckers arrested me and this is blackmail. Okay? I'm not doing this shit because we boys. I heard that you're so fast. You can run around a planet and find the back of <laughs> You can run around a planet and sign the back of your own head? Well, he's not wrong. He's not wrong. Docking seal released. Docking seal released. Where, where the fuck are we going? Hobos. Oh, Phobos. <laughs> Hobos. Sure, the Crimson Fleet. See, I don't think I can actually do these. Or I might piss off the homies. I don't know about a secret outpost on the dead. Wait a minute, what? Read the secret outpost. Wait a minute, do I have it in my pocket? All these goddamn blue dots everywhere in here. Um, inventory. It's going to be under miss, right? Okay, it ain't, it's literally no damn where. That's where it is. Dude, I got to get this, this fucking kid and this dude off my ship. I'm tired of him talking in the back of my fucking brain all the time. Uh, did you know that no one gives a fuck? All right, you don't fuck the mantis right now. Let's work, Mix King. Let's go. Travel to the key. Set course. Fuel consumption. You have not explored every system along this route. Try to jump into a closer system. I mean, like this. Try and stop me. Go. 
grab jump. Sick. Must have been a good jump. We're still in one piece. The hell was that? The Alamagist. Pressure sure outpost. Deserted relay station. What is this? Abandoned mine. Wow. Ooh, this place is kind of sick. What is this? Iron? Uranium? Argon? Where's this purple shit? Carbolic acids? Where's that purple shit at? Iron, water, uranium, and argon. I need to find a place. That's got all three like next to each other. Pretty close. I mean, iron, this is what? That's uranium, okay. So we want red, blue, and green all together. This kind of looks like an area. That could be good. That's not it, that's not it. Yeah, that one area, I think this is probably the best. This is mountains, though. Hmm. I don't know if I'll be able to cross through those. What are this? Is this mountains, too? We could try it. Try to land right here. And, uh, got stuff all around me. Or, hear me out. Fuck that planet. <clears throat> Let's go see what the hell this thing is. No one's answering. Sounds like I'm about to raid it. Nice clean dock, Captain. Thanks. Head to my crew position. Oh my god. Oh, this is kind of this is kind of wild. There's a spacer here. On now. Oh shit, already? Shit on. <laughs> I never liked him anyway. You're going to hate this then, bitch. Come here. Hmm. Oh my god, it blows me back. Holy shit! Come here, bitch. Sit your ass down. You'll be all right. You'll be fine. Who's shooting at me? Listen here, bitch. Mm.
Do you want me to go handle this for you, baby girl? Because you're having a rough we'll go of it. God, it's so sick that you get blown back because of the recoil. Where do you think you're going, bitch? Huh? Shit on. Poison. Credits. Nice, nice. Bitch, you get chased! <laughs> oh, shit! Games. Who are you talking to, bitch? Oh, I'm about dead. Ah, next time. Ah, next time. Where my pistol at? Okay, let's go behind the bar. Spaces are the scavengers of space. Like maggots feeding off of dead carcasses left in the sun. Okay. You just like to talk shit about spacers? Hey, fella. You're dead. Hmm. Oh. I'm not gonna lie, zero gravity makes the fights just so different. Oh shit. I've had of this. this pistol is absolutely disgusting. I mean it is it is gross. It is nasty. Where was I at? I think I was in there. Yep. Yeah. So maybe we go down here. Have I seen you? Nope. Corner drip shank, cartridge, digi pick. Hello? System error. System error. System error. I will say, low grab also makes it incredibly hard to know what the fuck you're supposed to be doing. There's system error on all these. machine looks functional if we could find the missing numbers perhaps we'd be able to win the jackpot for ourselves what this gambling machine looks functional oh hell yeah Sentient AI adapters, black market. Oh, these are contrabands. Input jackpot combination. I 
bitch. Okay, there we go. 22, 16, 36, 32. Failure. Oh, fuck. Okay, we got to go figure out how these numbers. I'm not going to spend all damn day on this, by the way. See some green shit. All these are masters. Might be worth taking a look through this. Toxin, lead. Okay, that's it. Time to sell some of your junk. Relax, bitch. Remember, there's a fuel needed for grab jump by one. Nice. Manager's computer. Twelve nineteen thirty six five. 12, 19, 36, 5. 12, 19, 36, 5. 12, 19, 36, 5. Pay out my fucking winnings. $3,700. Hmm. Hmm. Get the hell out the way. I'm gonna go double check and make sure. Actually, wait. Yeah, we're good. Where did I just get that combination from? You can sift through this place, but spacers rarely leave behind anything that holds value. Goes up here. Got it. Were any of these novice? This one is master, novice, advanced. Useful for us. What? The fucking computer? Yes, I do, bitch. Okay. So if I do... Okay, that key it does that. Okay, if I use that one... Okay. I'm pretty sure it's this one. Oh, there's three. Hang on. So it's this one and this one. Yeah. So boom, boom. And then this one is here and here, right? Give me that shit. We done figured that shit out. Uh, what's that? Bullets, money, $3,000 pistol. We'll take it. Advanced. Well, I can unlock advanced. That's right. Okay, so it's not going to be this key. Okay, let's say it's that key. Okay, I don't think it's that. I think it's this key and this key. Yep. Okay. It's not going to be that one. It's going to be this one and this one. I mean, come on. That's how fucking easy it is. That, that. Little thousand credits, modified arc welder. Hmm. Take that. Take that. I can't unlock masters. You know, actually, I got a I got two skill points. Okay, I'll be real honest. I didn't mean to spend that. I did not mean to spend it. Um, you can attempt to hack expert locks. 
Wait a minute. What did I say I wanted to do? It was something to do with... um. You can build outposts on planets with extreme temperatures. Okay. So I got to do all of this to get there. Let's resume the hand scanner. Oh, dude. It doesn't matter. I'm doing security stuff first. I don't want to leave anything behind because I couldn't... Because I couldn't lock it. I couldn't lockpick it, you know what I mean? You gonna point that gun in my fucking mouth? Or can we... So... You're telling me that instead of having to fly out of here, oh no, I'm carrying too much. Okay. That's okay. How the fuck do I get back out of here? I don't even remember how I got in here. Did I come up or down? Here we go. As far as vermin goes, I'm slot spaces right in between rats and cockroaches. Oh my God, I went to heaven. Where are we at? Yo, I cannot remember how the fuck I got in here. This says exit, right? Exit, left and right. But I don't think it is. Oh, thank goodness you see security keeps these spaces off of Jemison. This is not where I came in. Actually, it might be. Yeah, I remember now. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah. Is that another way to go? Or is it just all lead to the same place? Okay. I'll lead to the same place. Boom. Good to be back on board. Is it weird that I still get nervous around you? We're literally best friends. <laughs> are we? Are we literally best friends? All right. So this is what I'm wearing. Okay, what I'm wearing is still better. Randomly deals poison damage and slows the target. I need to give this bitch a better weapon because I swear she'd be using a damn pistol. Yeah, what is it? Let's trade gear, shitter. Glad to haul whatever you need. Good. You're carrying a lot. Sarah. She's carrying a coachman. She's carrying all kinds of shit, to be honest. So you can give me this fucking ammo, though. I know you don't need it. Are she using the Equinox? I see this clicked right here, so I think she's using that. 
So we'll take that from her so she doesn't use it. If I click this, that's me equipping it, huh? Not her. Go to my inventory. Weapons. I'm going to give you this. Actually, no, I'm going to keep that. Yeah, take this. Does one damage the less armor one has. She can't care anymore. Bitch, I just took a gun from her. Take that nice pistol, okay? Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. Enjoy your new gun. Dude, I need to upgrade my ship or my cargo bay or something. Actually, whoa, 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 whoa. Stand your ass up. Stand your ass up. Because I built all that shit, I wonder if I got some room in my cargo hold now. I do have a little. Now we take resources. Store all resources. Boom. Now we're at 140. Let's go. See, we're brilliant. Okay, we're absolutely brilliant. So, miss, stay up late reading under the covers. Oh my god, this dude. Did Shut you up! <laughs> Don't pretend to be mad at me. <laughs> I know you aren't really. Leave them on this damn ship. Used to use the stars to navigate. Oh my god, so many people talking. I'm gonna lose my shit. Show on map. What is this symbol? I'm gonna go here just in case this is because you remember I've got contraband on me. Cargo hold. We're fine. That's so cool. But I guess it only worked because they just lived on one planet. And that sounds Time for grab great. jumps. <laughs> Remind me one of these days to tell you the tale of a certain song we call where his stargazing left him. Well, you didn't put us into a planet, so we must be in the right place. Poor guy. Colonies of the system, come to my farm. Hmm. Unfortunately for you, I'm not doing that shit right now. Oh, wait a minute. This is... Should we go check it out? Okay, we're not gonna do that right now. Oh my God, I could get so sidetracked. We're trying to get here. We're about to be out of fuel. I'll be back. Switching over to standard engines. Cool. Thank you. Scan this bitch. Stream environment. They really ain't got shit. Ooh. Close to that damn sun. That star, I tell you that. Okay, a little further out. Jump to Cricks. Damn, that's a big ass compound right there. Nobody hit 
details, McKee. Just do your business. Okay. I apologize. <laughs> I apologize. I'm just trying to be respectful. I ain't trying to get blown out the fucking sky. Airlock integrity looks good. After you, Captain. You said the tank was 10K, but it was 30. Big difference on 40% of 10 versus 30. You wanted 4K, you got 4K. Not my problem. If you're stealing from me, you bet your ass it's your problem. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. You kidding me? Way to make a mess in front of my new rook. Damn, it's hey, crazy. Take that ammo. Me and get caught. Better off dead. Sounds like you did the fleet a favor. Now toss this body out of an airlock before it turns into a damn air freshener. <laughs> the hell took you so long? Forget how to grab jump or something. Mm-hmm. Why? Did you miss me? Let's let's use extrovert since it's something I picked. Maybe for you. I'd rather shove a shotgun up my nose than remember the face of every low life rook who passes through this station. But all that aside, you made it. So now you get to hear a nifty history lesson. Pencils ready? Good. This floating scrap heap you're standing on is called the Keep. Used to be an old UC military star station, and now it's the fleet's base of operations. Might look a little beat up on the outside, but we keep it together. Other pieces of UC. Huh, I like that one. Hell yeah, it is. Just watch it back when you do. Cred sticks tend to disappear around here if you catch my meaning we'll be certain to keep a close watch on our belongings anyway i'll tell you all about the key but it's better if i show you too follow me okay all uh, right. can i sell some Mystery shit time. please so the key is in orbit around suvorov that's the very same ice ball where the United Colonies built a supermax prison they call the Lock. The UC is so clever. Supermax prison, Lock, Key. Ah, uh, cute, huh? <laughs> yep, I get it. I get it. Oh, damn. Now, we've got everything the fleet needs right here. Of course, you've got to pay for it. Remember, on the key, credits are king. What the hell is this? All right, all right, hang on, Nev. Before you get pissed, I've got my hands full. Jasmine, sweetie, I'm trying to give a tour here. So you want to tell me why those damn doors are sealed? It's called a malfunction, you know. That thing I spend most of my day dealing with, believe me, my people are on it. Have a little faith for once. Aww. And you always, Angel. This here is Jasmine. You need anything for your ship? She's got you covered. <gasps> yes, Jasmine. We'll hit up the depot next since these doors have given out on us. So anyway, we were talking about the lock. About a hundred years Just ago, make yourself at home, Sarah. Down there rioted and took over the place. After stealing some ships, they were actually able to make it up here and took over the key. About time you brought us new blood, Neva. I was getting tired of weapons, with general good faces. Oh my god. You're just this place is awesome. Wise to your ridiculous prices, Aludra. Anyway, welcome to the depot, Rook. Where you'll be lucky if these blood sucking leeches don't bleed you completely dry. Whoa, whoa. It's not our fault that people don't appreciate how much it costs to get untraceable merchandise onto the key. Neva's just whining because she thinks she lost a ton of cash selling us a shipment of gear. She should have done her homework. Yeah, sure, laugh it up. I'll remember that next time I need something from you cheapskates. 
Let's move on. <clears throat> Back to my story. I don't need After to hear about you. Just to make it quick. <laughs> I'm not listening to you. Okay. I don't want to buy. I want to sell. Is miscellaneous where my black... Mm -hmm? Look at that. I... Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, she's only got fucking $4,000? Well. Let's take all of that. Confirm. Okay. Tell you what, now let's buy. Okay. Wait a minute, this is still my stuff. They established it as a this better <laughs> She's still talking. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh, I sold her that. Okay. Resources. I got to be careful. I don't want to buy too much of this shit. See how many I've got, right? So anything I don't have any of, I'll buy. Okay. I've got some of all of this shit. What about aid? Meal pack, drink pack. Chick. You about to piss me off. And begin pirating your oh. Bye, I guess. <laughs> well, well. Oh, well, well, indeed. Hot shot. <laughs> I knew you'd find your way back to my little corner of the key. Everyone always does. Damn, that's crazy. Hey, if you want to pork, I carry most of the standard hardware. Occasionally, I stock. Just don't screw me over or I'll be. You can trust me, shitter. And you want me to just take your a little advice, Sadiq? You bleed for the fleet. Anyone who says otherwise is either lying or getting ready to stab you in the back. Gotcha. Well, most people just glaze over and learn the hard way. Well, maybe there's more to you than I thought. Bitch, I just want to buy something. For the love of God. Plenty of. Okay, first off, I want to sell you some shit too. So we go now to the to uh, uh, miscellaneous. Go ahead and hit you with the little bop, bop, bop. Okay. Fuck. Take your. It doesn't seem like there's any way to go back to buy once you click over to sell. Maybe I'm tripping. I'm probably tripping. Fourteen thousand. Oh, <gasps> uh. bear laser sight, compensator, large magazine, hair trigger. Oh, it's so gorgeous. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> this is too much. Okay, we'll say. But I feel like this is not too much. I said I've been wanting a sniper. I'm going to buy it. I'm buying this. Call me crazy. But now she's got plenty of credits that I can uh, get back. What kind of ammo did that take? 11? Sure. All right, that many. Where's my shotgun shells? I got 245? When the fuck did I get 245 shotgun shells? Or is this what I need? Let's try this. I think I might need those. Okay. Aid. Okay, you ain't got shit. Selenius, that's what I sold you. Oh, I think. Okay, yep. I cycle through. Sell. Sell from ship inventory. Buy. Okay, okay. Now you can buy. All of that shit back. 
I actually need some digi picks if you have those. Okay. All right. See you around. So this weapon. Oh my god, I'm excited. Okay, first off, where are my favorites? You better be number four. Okay. Where's my feather? There it is. B. We'll put this as number... Put that there. Dude, this does five damage, this does four damage. Like, they do fuck all for damage. I'll put this guy... Right there. This guy does a lot of damn damage. This pistol does a shit ton of damage, too. Okay. Um, where was that? Where's my extended barrel boy? Was this him? Long barrel? Yeah, that's him. Okay. I'm going to put it in over this maelstrom. Okay. And now, now you buy from me, you can look the right gear. Just relax, okay? I don't need a whole fucking bunch of talking. They sell spacesuits. They suck. These suck. Got it. Oh, yes. All right, all of those. Nice. That was huge. Stay safe out there. Six more lockpicks. <clears throat> I'm sorry, you were saying? Meet Zuri, queen of the rare exports. Oh. If I don't have it, you don't need it. Neuro amps, blueprints. Hit her up and she'll take care of you. Okay. Speaking of which, you still owe me for that last purchase, Neva. It's like five figures. Don't make me collect it the hard way. <laughs> the hard way? Oh, no. Rook, protect me from Zuri's vengeance. I got you. Enough of the bullshit, Zuri. I'll pay you when I pay you. Deal with it. Got a problem with that? Take it up with the boss. I hope On you the came right, with credits. You've got Bradley from the Trade Authority. I'm sure you know the deal there. They'll buy pretty much anything, no matter how hot. Then we got our bed bay on Don't even try to rip me off. We can talk about whatever you want. Oh, why did I get this instead? Oh my god. Oh, I should have bought this instead. The fuck is this? Oh my god, dude. I want this bad. I'm not gonna buy it though. I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off. I'm gonna hold off. Yo, these suits are insane. Look at the resistances on this. They're like almost double. Everything is almost double. Energy here is two and a half times as much. Wow. Okay, that shit's tight. Tight, tight, tight. Dude, everything she got is so sick. Wait a minute, what am I wearing?
Plus five carry capacity. Oh shit, that's what I'm wearing. Okay. Miscellaneous. What do you got? Intake computer, ornate. Okay. I'm gonna buy that and that and that and that because I don't have any. Count of Monte Cristo. I love that movie, by the way. I mean, I know it's a book. It's a great book. But the movie, I actually really, really like. This bitch sells some dope stuff, by the way. Like, I feel like I need to buy this. Just because it is so tanky. It weighs a fuck ton, though. Oh, my God. All right, maybe we just uh maybe we just hold off for now. Match you up. Don't be a stranger. We don't run any free clinics up in here, you know? Okay. This is our final stop. Over there, you've got the last Nova, where Bog serves watered down drinks at ridiculously exorbitant prices. Okay. And right here is the most important place on the entire station. The Reckoner's Core. Run by the incomparable Shinya Voss. Another new rook, Neva? I can't believe Delgado still lets you recruit, given what happened with the last one. You mean Austin Ray? It's been taken care of, all right? I don't like loose ends, and this rook is the one who tied it off. Perhaps next time you'll try to be a bit more discerning regarding your choices. It's far more cost effective. Yeah, yeah, love you too, darling. Anyway, Shinya handles our lifeblood. The money. We call him our Reckoner, but if you ask me, he's actually a pain in the ass. <laughs> and Neva will slit your throat if she thinks you'll bleed creds. Go to hell, boss. Take care of our new friend here, or I'll find a way to pull the pin on that little party popper in your chest. What is that? Anyway. Shinya will get you set up in our system. I've got real work to do. Once you're done, head upstairs and I'll introduce you to the boss. Time okay. for a proper introduction. Hey, what's up? I am Shinya Voss, the official reckoner for the Crimson Fleet. And since Neva so thoughtfully mentioned it, yes, this is a bomb embedded in my chest. And no, I'll never know the meaning of the word humble. In <laughs> fact, I find Delgado's idea of a security measure to be quite empowering. Ah! Okay, so this is implanted by the boss because he's the money guy. If he's ever doing anything crazy, he'll just blow his ass up. Glad you approve. Obviously, betrayal isn't taken lightly around here. Since I oversee the bulk of transactions and maintain all accounts for the fleet, I'm a prime target for information. Should our enemies capture me or I grew any semblance of a moral conscience, you might consider me the greatest threat we have. For Delgado, the bomb grants peace of mind and a certain degree of safety. That is smart, I gotta say. It's why he's the boss. Of course, I'm not the first Reckoner to bear a bomb under my rib cage, but Delgado was smart enough to continue the tradition. Now, let me get you set up. A moment while I convene with the core. Thanks to advanced modifications even Dugin would envy, I can interface directly with our mainframe and the Galbank network. This allows me to move and clean credits faster and more efficiently than any run-of-the-mill cyber runner. Huh. There. You're done. I don't All feel you rich. Need now is Delgado's blessing, and you'll be one of us. Any other modifications I need? None. Other than my chest and arm modifications, I am but a simple man. Is the interview over now? Can we get back to work? Time to make those the credits. The perfect segue into my final subject. 
Thanks to our relations with contacts across the galaxy, we always have a steady stream of jobs available. I've granted you all the necessary permissions to access these listings at any time using the computers that surround the core. Yes. If Neva's chosen wisely, we certainly will. Now, I believe that covers all I have to say. So you can run along to Delgado. Take the elevator to the upper level. You should be able to find your way from there, I hope. Okay. All right, listen up. You can all stop complaining. Atrium to cargo bay doors have been repaired. Oh, and you're welcome, Nev. You. Rook. Nobody. Shut a few bulls at the ranch today. Nobody. Buy myself a drink. Did she get the door open? I like my weapons like I like my coffee. Scalding. What's up, Jasmine? I need ship services. Everyone you need it? I've got it. That's who I need. So, looks like we got ourselves a new rook. Yep. Once again, I'm Jazz, resident engineer here. Yeah. Like Neva said, you need ship parts, repairs? I'll hook you up. As long as your credits are good. Um. Let's see if we start collective. It may not be wider, but it's not on the books, if that's what you're getting at. I can guarantee your ship will be in good hands. So if you're looking for an upgrade, let me know. I am. We got the best selection in the settled systems. Illegal, unregistered, recalled. We sell it all. No questions asked. <laughs> no way. Legit manufactured parts only for me. No, 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 no. You buy from me, you're worry-free. I can't have my customers getting caught now, can I? That's bad for business. Hell yeah. Anything that keeps the UC and Free Star Rangers off your tail is a must-have in my book. Just let me know when you want to talk business. Bitch, I want to talk business now. No, but just remember. A ship. See what ships you... Oh, I could get new ships. And I need your cash. Oh, how much is 70,000 fucking dollars? Oh, fuck. Wait a minute, sell. How can I sell? There's a fleet haunt. Yo, these things are sick. Okay, I gotta go back. No, 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 don't leave. Don't leave, I'm sorry. You've got stuff to smuggle. Sure. All right. Okay, here's here's my ship. <laughs> Value, $7,000. Cool. Shipbuilder. Shipbuilder allows you to fully design, modify, and paint your ship. The floor gauge to the right tells you where your new modules will appear. The floor gauge is at zero, for example. New modules will be placed in the center of your ship. Okay. What is this? Cargo? Options. Left control? Um, tell you what, let's, let's delete it. Like, how do I add some? Hang on a damn second. Um, okay, add G. Structural weapons, bays, cargo. I need the most fucking cargo I can get. Plus three twenty. 
Is there any of these that let you hold? Ooh, shielded cargo with hide contraband from the authorities. That sounds sick. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Wait a minute, how much does this hold? Plus 190, and this is plus 170. Okay, uh, y'all didn't see that, but I just spent like an hour messing around with my ship. And, um, I could not get what I needed. Okay. So now I'm hacking this bitch, I think. Okay, I'm not doing anything. Get, get my ass upstairs. All right, give me, give me the hell up out of here. Yeah. Yeah. Monks, shooting range, don't care, let's go. Dude, that was exhausting. We are ready to depart. That was absolutely exhausting. I was moving stuff around. It was cool to like play and try to learn, but uh, to do all that shit and not be able to get anywhere, it was frustrating. Anyway, ah, Delgado. So. Now that we are all here, it's time to get down to business. The two of you are the only rooks that have made the latest cut. The rest, well, let's just say they won't be joining us ever again. Neighbors willing to put her neck on the line and vouch for you, which means you've got what it takes to join the Crimson Fleet. Yep. You'd better not disappoint, or you'll find yourself answering to me personally. All right. Let's get started here. When you sign up with the Crimson Fleet, you're in it for the long haul. No one quits. No one retires. The only way out is death. You stay loyal or you pay the consequences. Fleet before friends. Fleet before family. Fleet before yourself. <laughs> Oh, yes. Hey, if you've got a problem, I can decorate that wall behind you with your brains. Room could use a little color if you ask me. It's all right, neighbor. I admire this Rook's backbone. Takes a lot of guts to crack jokes with the threat of death staring them in yeah, the face. Yeah, damn right it does. Can we get on with this? I want to get drunk at the last Nova. I'm impressed. That is the first intelligent thing you have said this entire time, Mathis. Since you two seem so eager to move forward, let's get to your next job. Pack your cold weather gear, Rooks. Where we are going, you're going to need it. Oh, God, don't tell me you're dragging him down to Suvaral for another one of your little initiation runs. Ten Johns to the surface, twelve dead Rooks. You'd think by now you would have given up on that goddamn campfire story. Crix's legacy is no story, neighbor. We've got fresh eyes in the fleet. And if these two want to impress, they're going to help me search those ruins. I hope you're right, Dale. That new code we grabbed for the lot cost us a ton of credits. And a decent captain. This initiation, as Neva calls it, is your chance to see where it all began. On Suvorov with Jasper Griggs. Griggs led the riots that gave birth to the Crimson Fleet. And if his legacy is still out there, we're going to be the ones to find it. Um. Through a bit of luck and a hell of a lot of cash, Neva was able to get her hands on an access code to the inside of the lock. This will be the first time someone from the Grinson fleet has set foot in there for, well, since Grix left the place behind. It has been frustrating being this close to potential clues, but not being able to find a way through those prison walls. Before Crix left the fleet, he left a message talking about a major score, one that would set up the fleet to be a big player in the settled systems. Somewhere down the line, they started calling it Crix's legacy, and everyone who's tried to find it has wound up empty-handed, missing, or dead. If we're gonna beat those odds, we'll first need a lead. And I would wager we will find one on Suvorov. 
Dale's leaving out the best part. That this whole search is based on a handful of words on a very old slate. Cricks left a lot of big talk on that recording. And not a lot of facts. Some of us believe in it more than others. <laughs> Don't listen to her. When we get our hands on Crix's legacy, the fleet will be operating at a completely different level. We will become more than a match for UC Sistef. We'll be unstoppable. Exactly. Now you're beginning to understand. Okay, enough discussion. We have got a lot of work to do. To that end, the next stop is the lock. I've had Jazz feed the coordinates into your ship's computer. Since Mathis doesn't have a ship, he's going to ride with me. I'll see you down there, Rook. Don't keep me waiting. Mathis doesn't have a ship. What a piece of shit. What a piece of shit. So there I am. You see security on my tail, and my grab drive just chokes. And you know what I find back there? The fattest what? I was gonna rob somebody right quick, but ain't nobody got shit. Go on down. Okay. I think this is where I'm gonna call it on this video. That damn the hour of ship messing around that you guys didn't get to see really took it out of me. I don't know about you, but I think the welcome sign really lends itself to the alluring charm of this star station. Agreed. Agreed. But I'm going to end it here, all right? Because, uh, like I said, I got tired because of that. We may not have official security. Oh, my God. Chief. Can you shut the... We're always looking out for traitors. Okay. Bitch, I'm trying to do my outro. So shut the hell up, all right? <laughs> Hopefully you're still enjoying it. Let me know what you think down below, and we'll catch you on the next video. All right, guys? Night.